Hi everyone. Welcome to the channel. The Pharmacy Talks. Today in this lecture we are going to discuss about the types of calcium oxalate crystals and the easy tricks and mnemonics to remember them. So before starting this video, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to turn on notifications. Let's start today's topic. Firstly we'll discuss about the cluster, crystals. The trick to remember the secondary metabolites of this type is Rusi Senna Farsi between cluster. It includes Rhubarb, Clove, Senna, Paninava, Hyosumus, Ailanthus glandulosa, which is adulteration of Belladonna, and Stramonium. Now let's talk about the other type of calcium oxalate crystals which is needle-shaped crystals. The trick to remember the secondary metabolites of this type is Needle Pack. It includes Phytolico Americana which is adulteration of Belladonna aloe, and campodica. Let's move on and talk about the other type which is prismatic crystals. The trick to remember the secondary metabolites of this type is, K. L. Rahul become wild when he saw three cute girls. It includes, kerchi, licorice, raw wolfia, wild, cherry, hyosumus, senna, stramonium, cascara, cardamom, coriander, and glycorrhizinic acid. Next type of calcium oxalate crystals is rosette crystals. The trick to remember the secondary metabolites of this type is Cofein. It includes Coriander, Fennel and Anise. All the Umbelliferous fruits also belong to rosette type of calcium oxalate crystals. Last but not the least type is Acicular crystals. It is further classified into two types. These are Single and Cluster. Let's first talk about the trick to remember single acicular crystals. The trick is single CBI in Germany. It includes cassa, bark, ipcac roots, and gentian. Now let's talk about the secondary metabolites of cluster acicular crystals. It includes squill and hyosumus. So that's all for today. We hope you find this video helpful. Please like the video and comment any topic which you want to learn in an easy way.